she's with uh, Laura Robson courtside. Maddie, huge congratulations. That was such a battle. You played each other before once. You came through that in straight sets. Not the case today. Were you expecting her to come out so strong? I actually practiced with her a few days before the tournament, and I said to my coach, like, wow, she's playing really great tennis. So I definitely knew I was going to have to play well. And I mean, I think she played a phenomenal first set, and I really had to raise my level. And I'm just happy that I got the win. Well, you went a set down, you started the match a little flat. It looked like the rhythm just wasn't quite there on the ground strokes. What was your coach telling you to turn that around after the first set? I mean, he was mostly just telling me to make the ball. It's kind of hard to win points when you're not putting many balls in the court. So that was the first step. And um, once I did that, I started feeling a little bit more confident and was able to start going for my shots a bit more. And the team bench played a big part of the match today. There was a lot going on down the other end. Team GB's bench was very loud. What did you want from them today? Were you asking for a bit more, a bit less? Honestly, I just let them do whatever they wanted to do. That's probably how it works out best. Um, you can't really control Francis, so if you try to put him in a box, he'll just rebel even more. So you just have to let him do what he wants to do. Um, but yeah, they were amazing, and it's such a great environment to be able to look over at any point and have um, all that support. Is it weird or is it helpful seeing other people in the top 10 giving you tactical advice in the middle of a match? Uh, it's a little strange, but I mean, I have Jess over here who obviously won a lot of matches, so whatever she tells me to do, I just try to execute. That seems to be the team consensus. Listen to Jess. Yes. She knows what she's doing. Jess is in charge always, so we just do what Jess says. And you've got a long day ahead of you, four more matches to go. How are you going to pace yourself? There's a lot of tennis to be played. I know, I'm really tired now, so I might have to take like a 20 minute time out and then I'll be back out here and um, giving them the same support that they gave me. Well, congratulations. You got the team to a 1-0 start. Give it up for Maddie Keys, everyone. Thanks.